Hey YouTube, I wanted to show you guys a part of this clip real quick. I just bought this flat iron called Nano Titanium. Oh my God, amazing. Look at the inside and it goes up to 450 degrees. And I like how thick it is. And I was like, does this really work? Cause I had the Paul Mitchell one before, but I was like, it's okay. It's not my favorite. So I pay, I think I pay like 140 for this flat iron. And it has a four year warranty on it. So I'm gonna go ahead and send, inform send in my information. So if it does start working the right way, you get it back. Cause you know, we all experience that with a flat iron. It just don't be worth it. And I'm all about spending money on quality things because then if you don't, you're gonna keep buying stuff over and over. And I'm doing the squats right now because I don't feel like getting a chair. But I just wanna show y'all how it bumps. Like I just got my hair cut yesterday. You like it, right? And I just wanna show y'all how it can bump so easy. Look at that, boom. Boom, see that? I ain't even touched this side. Let's see. Let's do the bang real quick. See how we can get a curl. Cause you know, sometimes we won't get no curl when we do a flat iron, but I'm into this little baby bliss. I'm not big on my curl and bangs, but hold on real quick. Look at how they get those ends. And it shines it too. It better for $150. Let's comb it out real quick. Oh yeah. Ooh wee. Can y'all tell the difference? I just wanted to show y'all that. Okay, thank you. On to my really reason why I came on here. It's me and this flat iron is life. Go get you one. <laughs> hey, to this your girl awesome so today I wanted to come to you guys with um, some swimsuits that I used to have that I haven't worn for a while because I didn't like how everything was looking like my stomach. So I want to try them on today for the first time and see what they look like after the tummy tuck two months post-op and show you guys as well. Um, what else did I want to tell you? I'm thinking. <laughs> uh, so let's go ahead and try on these swimsuits that I've had and uh, see how they look currently. I don't have before and after pictures of the swimsuit because when I bought the two pieces, they look great. So let's see what they look like at two months post-op. I have lost weight since surgery. March 22nd, I was like 263 pounds on the way in. I am now currently 248 pounds. And like I said, the last video I did a while ago, I had lost like 11 inches, but um, I'm still in, I mean, I only took seven pounds off my weight, like on my stomach, they only weigh seven pounds. So, you know, I still have some work to do, but I feel good for myself. I am 5'11 and uh, I'm not too bad for 248 pounds, but I have lost a lot of body fat and muscle mass. So it's weird how you weigh yourself. And that's why I like my scale because it tells me my muscle mass, my BMR, my body fat, my percentage. I may not have lost a pound, but I have went down in other things. So we have to not pay attention to the number so much because it's not all about the number. It's all about how you feel in your clothes and also how, um, what you're doing and what you're eating. Sometimes we decide, oh, I'm eating healthy, I'm not losing weight. Sometimes it didn't come on overnight. It's not gonna come off overnight, so we have to be patient. Anyhow, so I want to come to you guys and show you my swimsuits, okay. Well, these are some pictures of me and my old swimsuits that I've always had. And I was like, let me see how they fit on me now. I haven't worn them in a while, but I've always had them. And I did recently go look for some two pieces, but they weren't fit me right in the top. So I was like, I have other ones at home. So why waste money on stuff you already have? It just looked different. So I went in and tried these swimsuits on and I really like them. And it has been only two months, but I have a while to go. Like I really still don't feel confident in them currently, but, um, I'm thinking maybe by August, I will be where I want to be um, until I finish working on this. Like I said, I am 5'11". I am currently 248 pounds. I did lose 11. I don't know. I was 263. You do the math. Almost 15 pounds, whatever. Um, since surgery, March 22nd. So I'm 248. But I've lost a lot of body mass. And I feel like I've gained a lot. So I'm happy about my results. And um, 
um, I hope you guys continue to watch me on this journey. I don't know what kind of videos I'm going to continue doing because I'm having more subscribers and YouTube is like good for me to inform everybody. So I'm just trying to figure out what I want to do on this path. I don't know if I want to focus on my journey of weight loss or trying to figure out how I'm going to get a six pack or a two pack or a three pack for my birthday in November. So thank you for watching. Your girl awesome. And I appreciate all the love. Subscribe, like, unlike unsubscribe, whatever you like to do, it all helps. Thank you.